Mr. Mr. Wolkoff. Against his own. The avatar? Yeah, like that's I know you who are. <laughs> Uh, for those who don't know who I am, I'm Lou Walkoff. And my point of inquiry uh, is refers to something that was raised earlier. I would like to know if the chair can rule. I'd like to know if the chair can rule now if the sort of language that's being contemplated to be created by this committee would constitute a lesser change so that we can go ahead and finish the ratification this year or a greater change which would extend the ratification for another year. I think this is going to impact on how people are going to vote, and therefore I'd like to ask if he can do it. The chair is not going to make a specific ruling, seeing as how I don't know what the language would be. Uh, my general thought as a human being is that it would be a greater change, but that is not a chair's ruling until the language is in front of me to make any ruling on. Mr. Stanley, for what purpose does the member rise? I have a parliamentary inquiry requiring how much time, debate time remains on the motion to refer to committee. There is no time left against the motion. There is 40 seconds, 40 seconds in mind. favor. The, the, then the motion I was trying to make is out of order. Yes. <laughs> What, for what purpose does the member? Speech for. There's yep. 40, sec 40 seconds left. Name? I'm sorry. I'm Stephanie Sullivan. Um, my very short speech for is my concern at the moment is that we have to go with the language of the amendment as it reads. And as it reads right now, there is nothing that says that we are allowed to inform these authors that they had more than two works that were nominated. From what I understand of the process, we only tell them when they're on the final ballot. You had two. You don't know if you had four. So referring it to committee allows our potential finalists to have some say and some idea of what's going on with their works. Thank you. Seeing as time has virtually expired for both arguments for and against, I would like to put the question to the floor. Is there any objection? Yeah, objection. May, I make, uh, may I make a motion? No. no. There's a motion on the floor. Yeah, there's a motion and second order of motion. <laughs> what is your motion? Motion would be Come, to the, Come to the microphone. Very sorry, this will be quick. Um, as for some, yeah, oh, Jay, Jason Spitzer. As for some of the um, issues we're talking about, sending this to committee, I would move that. Sorry, I would move that we would strike. No, 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 you that can't. would be a second order amendment. Yeah. That's not in order. That's, That's not, not in order. order. Extend, the debate time would be in order. Mm -hmm. Yes. Oh, um, the, there's a motion. No, there's a motion to, rat, to refer to committee. I'd like to put, Mr. Yellow, for what purpose does the member rise? Uh, to make a motion to extend the time of debate to the future. Second. Second. How much? How much debate time would you like to extend Come by? Come to the microphone well, yes. and make the motion. Ben Yalo, it seems clear to me that people still have interesting and useful things to say about the motion to commit, and therefore I would move to extend debate time on the motion to commit by two minutes, equally divided. There is, so okay, so this requires a two-thirds vote in favor. All those in favor of extending debate, please raise your hands. All, okay, hands down, all those opposed. I'm gonna say the no's have it. Debate is not extended. Now, to the matter of referring to committee. All those in favor of referring to a committee to deal with the issues raised, please raise your hands. All right, hands down. All those opposed? I'm gonna say, the ayes have it, I think. I'm gonna say the ayes have it, unless somebody really needs a division of the house. All right, we're gonna do this again. Serpentine! <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna start on, 
We're going to start on this side of the room. Everybody who is in favor of referring to committee, please stand if you can. If not, raise your blue card. We're going to start on that side, work from front to back, then go through the middle section, front to back, and then my left, front to back. Mm -hmm. And then we'll get the head table at the end. I will not forget oh. you. <laughs> Sorry, we're going to go my right, front to back, center, right to back. Sorry. <laughs> left side, front to back, and then we'll... Oh, this is, is the exercise. This is, <laughs> this is serpentine vote on referring to committee. So if you are in favor, in favor, you are standing. Thank you. If you cannot stand... We'll start with Judy. 19. 20. 72. Is there anybody who wishes to vote in favor that believes they did not get counted? All right, so that's 73 in favor. Those opposed, please stand, if you can. And we're going to do the same method, starting on that side. Is there anyone wishing to vote against that did not get counted? All right. It being 73 to 60, the motion to refer to committee passes. No, refer to committee as a majority vote. The extent debate was the two-thirds. Yeah. Dr. Adams, would you like to chair the committee? I would be willing to do so. All right. Those members who wish to be on the committee, please see Dr. Adams when we take our recess. What, when we take our recess. Does, do we need, we need a videography recess? All right, so let's do a 10 minute recess. You can do that. People can see Dr. Adams and do other things. Uh, I believe it was one by the water.